Hey guys, welcome back. Thank you so much for joining me. Today we are doing a 15 minute total core workout and this one is going to be intense. You don't need any equipment, just make sure that you have some space around you and definitely something soft beneath you as we are on the ground for the entirety of this workout. So we have four different sets in this workout. We're going to repeat them each twice and that will bring us to 15 minutes. We're going to be taking very minimal rest, but I will also give you some modifications if you need to make this workout a little bit easier. I think that's it. So without further ado, let's get to it. All right, guys, we're first starting off on the ground. We're just gonna do some regular crunches for 30 seconds, feet up in a tabletop position, shoulder blades up, off the floor, and press that lower back into the ground. From here, we're going to do two crunches, and on your second crunch, you're going to hold and then drop the toes down and bring them back up. So, one, hold, drop, and lift. And when you drop those legs, I really want you to focus on pressing that back into the floor as much as you can. All right, from here, we're gonna do some elbow to knee. So dropping one leg at a time and bringing that opposite elbow to knee. All right, we're gonna flip it over into plank and we're just gonna hold. So, the end of this will be 30 seconds of plank, but you have the option you can also rest here if you want to lower the intensity a little bit. All right, we're gonna flip that over and we're going to repeat this set once again, starting off with our crunches. So back flat on the floor as you keep your gaze upward and lift those shoulder blades up off the floor. Getting ready for two drop, two crunches and a leg drop. So one, two, drop and lift. Getting ready for elbow to knee. Make sure you meet those elbows and those knees in the center. Good. We're gonna take a 30 second rest. So you could also hold plank if you wanna increase the intensity, but we're taking a 30 second rest and now we're moving into our second set. So next up, we're going to do some L leg switches. So you're propped up here on your elbows, straight leg, straight leg, bent leg, bent leg. If the straight leg is too much for you, you can just keep them bent. Just make sure that you're bringing those knees in as close as you can to your face. Here we go. 
So straight, straight, bent, bent. Keep that chest nice and open and lifted. All right, we're gonna lay all the way down on our backs and we're just gonna do some reverse crunches. So legs extend, bring it in, knees to your face and lower. Really focus on that crunch movement. Upward, press that back into the floor. Good, all right, extend those legs up. We're going to crunch and open those legs. Press that back into the floor as you crunch up. Good, sit up. Our last 30 seconds of this set, we're gonna pulse it out. So sit back, engage those lower abs, keep the tension on those lower abs, and just breathe. Good, we're gonna repeat that all again. Starting off with our L leg switches. One, two, and bend. If keeping your legs hovering above the ground the whole time is too much, you can tap the bottom leg to the floor. Good, going right into those reverse crunches. Again, if you want to lower the intensity of this movement, you can just tap those toes on the floor and keep those legs bent. Good, legs extend upward. We're crunching. Good, set it up and pulse it out. You can also take a breather here if you'd like. We're gonna move right into our next set. We're coming down on our backs. We're gonna do one side for 30 seconds. You're going to crunch elbow to knee and then fingers to toes. Reach for those toes. All right, in between, from either side, we're going to do our leg drops in between. So drop those legs, keep that lower back pressed into the floor, and then bring the toes all the way up. Nice and slow, but make sure you're really controlling 
and you're using those lower abs by pressing that back into the floor. From here, we're gonna do the other side. Elbow to knee, fingers to toes. All right, last 30 seconds, we're going to hover. So again, press that lower back into the floor and hover those legs at about a 45 degree angle. If you don't feel the strain on your abs, you can lower those legs a little bit. And we're just going to hold and breathe. All right, we're gonna repeat that set once again. Here we go, starting off with one side, elbow to knee, fingers to toes. Getting ready for leg drops. Bring those feet up, drop them down, and back up. Press that lower back into the floor. Getting ready to go to the other side. Good, bring those legs up and hover. If you want to increase the intensity a little bit, you can cross those feet, kind of scissor kick them or flutter kick. From here, we're moving into our next set. We're gonna roll over onto one of our sides. We're gonna do one side at a time do some side crunches. So, roll over, extend that bottom arm out, come up for a crunch, and lower. Up and down. Good, drop those legs, bring that top leg up, elbow to the top of your leg, and really squeeze that side. Good, from here, we're propping ourselves up on our elbow. Hold that side plank. If you want to increase the intensity, you can do some hip dips.
good. Flipping it over, we're gonna repeat all of that on the other side. Extend that bottom arm, come up and down. Good, drop those legs. One leg comes up and we're crunching it out. Make sure you're meeting that elbow and the knee in the center. Keep it going guys, we're almost there. Getting ready for plank. Last 30 seconds, here we go. Prop it up to increase the intensity. Hip dips. Come on guys, 20 seconds, don't give up. That's it guys, great job. All right guys, I hope you enjoyed this quick 15 minute killer ab workout. If you did, give this video a thumbs up for me. Leave me your feedback down below. Let me know how you did. I'm always listening to your feedback and reading your comments and I truly appreciate it. If you guys are new here, make sure you hit that subscribe button, turn on your post notifications so you don't miss another video from me. And I'll see you guys very soon. Bye.